Have you ever come across a small bee or a wasp and it scared you out of your mind? It might feel silly to be afraid of such a small insect. However, your instincts are right on track. Sometimes the smallest little bugs are some of the most dangerous, and that can include the bees and wasps that are in your backyard right now. When you hear buzzing coming from a nearby tree, you might immediately take notice. We really love honey, but nobody likes a bee sting. While a simple bee sting from a honeybee is unlikely to cause much harm, some people are allergic to a specific chemical in the bee venom. They can have severe reactions to the bee venom, causing them to go into anaphylactic shock that causes swelling and difficulty breathing. Luckily, a quick dose of epinephrine through an EpiPen can quickly counteract the bee venom. But if the person can't get that dose, they could possibly die. But there are bees and wasps that are dangerous even to those without a bee venom allergy. First off, there's the hybrid honeybee called the Africanized honeybee. These bees are an invasive species that take over local honeybee hives. These bees are more aggressive than your average honeybee. If they perceive a threat to their home, like a human accidentally disturbing their hive, the bees can go into hyper-defensive mode. They can swarm a person in a cloud of up to 60,000 bees strong, stinging the victim thousands of times. The stings from these thousands of bees can cause tissues and body functions to break down almost immediately. People have been known to suffer cardiac arrest and die almost instantly from these bee swarms. If you see a hive, stay clear and notify animal control to take care of it. But even those bees are no match for the giant Asian hornet. These guys are up to two inches in length and eat bees for breakfast, literally. They're a carnivorous species of hornet and contain a neurotoxin that shuts down their prey's nervous system. They're also prone to hyper-defensiveness. If a person gets stung by even one of these hornets, they can go into anaphylactic shock and die. The deadliest of all, though, is the Vespa luctuosa, a species of wasp found only in the Philippines. It has the most toxic venom of any bee or wasp, and only a couple insects in the whole world are known to be more toxic. A single bite from this little wasp is extremely painful and can lead to convulsions, your skin turning blue, and even death. Luckily for us, they rarely build their hives around humans, so unless you're walking through the Filipino wilderness, you're not likely to meet one. Whether you're allergic to bees or not, though, be careful. Some of them might be more dangerous than you think, so it's always best to keep your distance and not take any chances. Even if you get a honey craving and see a hive, under no circumstances should you disturb them. Leave it to the pros, and both you and the bees will be much happier. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for lots more Fuzzy and Nuts!